So you might be in a position where your MetaQuest 3, your phone is just not connecting to that particular device. Now, this can happen for a few different reasons. The very first thing and very first reason I'd recommend kind of looking at is to make sure that your particular phone isn't actually, you know, on an outdated version of that MetaQuest application. That's happened to me a ton of times. So what I'd recommend doing is going onto your Android, iPhone, whatever device you have, and just going through and updating your specific device. So update that application. And for a vast majority of people, that will probably end up fixing the problem for you. Now, if you do that and that's still not working, the next thing I'd recommend doing is making sure your Quest headset is actually updated. So go through and, you know, go to your MetaQuest headset and go ahead and just see if you can actually update that specific headset. Go inside of your settings most of the time, updating either the application, updating your phone, or updating the headset will end up fixing the problem for pretty much every single person out there. So go ahead and do that, and you might want to double check if that ends up fixing the problem, which like I said, probably for everyone, that probably will end up fixing the problem. Now, if you do that and that's still not working, the next thing you may want to try doing is making sure that you are connected to some sort of internet connection on your particular devices, and you want to make sure Bluetooth is on, you want to make sure your devices are turned on and there's no issues like that either. Because if you're not connected to the right Wi-Fi, if, you're not, if your Wi-Fi connection is spotty, if your Bluetooth's not on, different things like that, that can also cause some issues again. Now, the other thing that Meta kind of recommends you to do is to just restart your devices. So just go through, restart your phone and restart your headset and see if any of those things end up fixing the problem too. Like I mentioned, probably for every single person that will probably end up fixing the problem. And that might be all you have to do from that standpoint as well. If that's still not working, you can try going through and again, upgrading your system, seeing if that ends up fixing it. But probably the steps I mentioned before will probably end up fixing the problem for you. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.